My first solo trip was the emotional roller coaster. Actually learning to live 24 hours a day with yourself was something I'd underestimated. I was so busy thinking, I'm going to sail this boat on my own without the 17 crew. I kind of forgot the psychological aspect of it. Energy has a massive effect on your emotions. So I was crying one minute and I was loving it the next minute. And I had no understanding of what was influencing these emotions that were coming out of me. All I knew was it was using a lot of my energy. So the transition from my first solo trip to the second solo trip was all about the sports psychology. 